Hello, everybody, and welcome to CAD 1133. My name is Scott Card, and I'm going to be your professor this semester in CAD for Electronics. This semester, we're going to be using a software called Proteus. The school has paid for a license for you uh, that is floating so that you can work at home. So I need you to make sure right away that you uh, do have access to, to the software, because as you learned last semester, there is a lot of homework in CAD. Now, you're all familiar with using uh, Proteus to some level, but what we're going to do is we're actually going to use this as if we were in uh, a work environment. So we're going to go much, much further into using Proteus as a CAD tool. What does that mean? So, so far you've been using Proteus as, as a test bench tool, okay? And we're going to take it a step further. We're going to take these little sub circuits and we're going to make a large circuit. And uh, it's going to seem daunting at first, but remember that uh, most circuits are actually able to be broken down into smaller pieces, the sub-circuits as they call them. And each one of these sub-circuits works in unison. And so that's, that's the mindset. And so we're going to break it up in, in, into little pieces. But then once we have our circuit all together, what we're going to do is we're going to uh, create a PCB using this larger circuit. And again, we're going to break it down into pieces so that we lay it out in segments. And it, you'll find that this is a great technique for making sure that you don't become overwhelmed or forget something. Once we're finished that, we're actually going to create a bill of materials and order the parts. You're actually going to order your own parts. And so this is a great opportunity for you to get some experience uh, placing, placing orders, searching parts, and dealing with all of the things that we have to deal with in the electronics industry. Once your parts come in, you're going to assemble it. Uh, we're going to program it, uh, and then we can test it. And at the end of this, you will have a circuit board that you can utilize. You can, you can actually do something with, and uh, you, you're going to find that this is a great way to work all the way through an entire circuit design from concept to production to testing to then would be manufacturing. All right. I love this course. I love teaching it. I've loved developing it. It's been a, a real, a real eye opener for me to, to really look into each and every aspect and, and teach new people uh, things that we take for granted. And so I hope that you're as excited about learning this as I am about teaching it and uh, really buckle in and enjoy the ride. But do remember that uh, you need to be proactive in this class. Okay. Uh, each week builds upon the last. And so it's really important that if you do miss a week, you get caught up. You're not going to be able to miss a piece because each piece is, is intricate to the next. All right. So if you do find yourself falling behind, please contact me right away. Let me know your situation and we'll see what we can do to rectify it. All right. So questions or comments, please send me an email. Uh, otherwise, uh, have a great day and uh, enjoy the class. All right. Bye now.